making his way to the ring from the Amazon, weighing in at 205 pounds, Voda. As we ready for singles action, Byron, what can you tell us about these two competitors? Well, I can say that both of these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance here tonight. But as we all know, only one will walk away with their arm raised in victory. And his opponent, from Air Scotland, weighing in at 250 pounds, William Wallace. Singles action on its way, and it sounds like this arena is more than ready to kick this one off. So is social media, Michael. The opening bell hasn't even rung, and yet both these superstars are already trending. The flying forearm finds his target. This matchup has the potential to be special. We could be moments away from an instant classic. Perfectly executed. It's on, he's got it on. This pushes the already bruised muscles to the absolute limit. Is he gonna tap? I don't know how long he can endure the agony. Look at this! This guy can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody. He's throwing the rule book out the window. Look at this. It looked like his whole neck just crumbled there. Maneuvers like that put everybody in danger. to stumble here. He needs to create some space oh. and find a way to get back on the offensive. He may be in the best nice. physical condition I've ever seen him in. Rolling thunder! This might be the opportunity he needed. Big move coming! Wait for it! Frog splash! Oh, it's over! Can he end it quickly? Seems to me, guys, like we're just moments away from seeing the finisher, which could obviously put this match on ice. And he's starting to feel it here. I don't think he expected ah. to be in this position here. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This oh, is man. Just a little bump in the road for him here. Nothing to worry about. He's fighting from underneath. The finisher could absolutely end this match, Michael, as you were saying, but it's not a guarantee. Sometimes it takes two or even three to get the job done, and even then, it's not a sure bet. 
a la Randy Savage versus the Ultimate Warrior at WrestleMania 7. That's my favorite match of all time. Randy Savage landed an amazing five top rope elbow drop, but was still unable to put Warrior away. And you know what? He forces his way free. Man, he just has so much resolve. He's showing amazing agility here. Whoa! He's fighting from underneath. Incredible! He's fighting from underneath. He wants it one more time. Drop kick. Beautiful. That might be it. He's fighting from underneath. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very shortly, guys. And when that happens, you can bet this one's going to be over. As we all know, this superstar has a title opportunity coming up. And when that happens, you can bet we'll have a new champion. He's looking hapless out there. I'm with Corey. I suspect the finisher is on the horizon. And given how impactful that move has been as of late, I'd say there's almost no coming back from it. You're right, Michael. It seems like that finisher has become more and more impactful with each passing week. But that's even possible. He's fighting from underneath. He's fighting from underneath. Starting to struggle. How much more punishment needs to be dished out? Just finish it. And I'm not sure he even knows where he is. I'm not sure he has much left. Oh, man, he has plenty of reason to be concerned here, guys. But you know what? So does his opposition. This is about as close as it gets. We know what's coming here. Drop kick. Here's his moment, Michael. And he goes for the pin. One, two, three. Yes! Unreal performance. That was an awesome win for this young man. One of the biggest of his career by far. What a battle. Respect to both competitors. And this I love. This I absolutely love. Maybe you should have taken a page out of that kid's book in your career, Corey. Great sportsmanship. I would have hit him in the mouth. <laughs> 